We tend to look at food as a very personal act, you know, like how does it taste to me or what effect does this have on my body? What effect, what happens to my body if I don't eat enough of this food? It's always looked at through, you know, your own set of eyes, from my perspective. And I think that food is a much broader act than that. It, it impacts everything in the world around and we don't always know uh, that this is the case. I mean, if I give you an example of the environment, you know, the types of foods that we eat that de determines the demand for foods in the market, that determines what foods get grown. Agriculture, okay? Agriculture is essentially how we use our world. You know, a great example of this is the old system of farming is basically sun beams down, uh, grass grows, we're using minerals from the soil, water, CO2 from the air, and you create uh, biomass, the plant grows, the grass or the plant grows. And then we either eat the plants or we eat the animals that eat the plants, okay? And then the animals that have eaten the plants do the, do the stuff out the back end that then fertilizes the soil and creates that so that the next lot of plants can grow. That's that closed loop. The new system of farming, which is based on speed, efficiency, you know, industrial farming, cheapness, uh, this is where you take a load of different inputs, uh, you know, you take the cows off the, off the grass, you put them in the factory, huge amounts, you know, you start feeding them corn so they can grow quicker because you want speed, and grass doesn't do it, so you feed them corn which makes them sick, so you put antibiotics in to stop them from dying, and that then gets into our, our food supply, and you know, because you haven't got the dump out of the cow's backside because they've been taken off the field, you have to then fertilise the soil, that's with fossil fuels, and fertiliser gets into our water supplies and makes us sick, and you know, it's an incredibly wasteful system in, in the first system, sun, uh, natural system, uh, cow, fertilizer, soil, etc. 2.3 calories of food was produced, one calorie of fossil fuels to make that food. In the new system, it takes 10 calories of fossil fuels to make one calorie of food. It's incredibly wasteful. 5,000 gallons of water to produce a pound of beef. Okay, so when you make your food choices, you have to understand that you are essentially either adding to a healthy world or you're using up the world. Okay, something to think about here because we always look at it from our perspective, it's just what's it gonna taste like? But you have to understand, the foods that we eat determine how we use our world. Food is a very unusual system because we are always told in my home country, I'm told it's a democracy. And then when I look at what happens after you vote certain people in power, they do whatever they want. Okay, that you know, if you go to war, there's millions of, people's mar millions of people marching, most of the country doesn't want to do it, yet we go anyway. Okay, it's the illusion of democracy. But food is the ultimate democracy, it really is. Because if you think, oh, you know, the food environment is a travesty, how dare they? You're misguided, because you voted for it. You know, if we weren't buying that food, it wouldn't have become this big issue. You know, and, and I know it's not just our fault because we, we weren't aware that it wasn't real food, but now we know we can cast our vote three times a day. Your stomach grumbles, you pick up your fork and you vote. And you think to yourself, what kind of world do you want to see? If you want a world with more processed food, more fast food, more junk food for your kids and for yourself, if you want a more dangerous food environment, all you have to do is eat more of that food and you're doing your bit. And look at that on the other side. You know, whether you eat a cheese string or an organic egg, you know, whether you eat a factory processed burger or an organic free range meat from a farmer's market, you are building one world or you are building another.